first thing we need to determine is the diameter of the band heater. Use outside calipers to find the diameter of the barrel. The calipers should slide over the barrel with minimum resistance. Alternately, use a flexible tape measure to wrap around the circumference of the barrel. Take this measurement and divide by pi, 3.14, to find the diameter. Using outside calipers, measure the opening, and this is the diameter of your barrel. Next, we need the width. This particular band heater is three inches wide. Next, we will look at the gap. A one-piece band heater will have a gap that is 5 sixteenths of an inch, standard. A two-piece band heater will have two gaps. Each will be 3 sixteenths of an inch, standard. Next, we need to find the length of the leads as well as the length of the hose or braid for lead protection. We then clearly define all holes or notches. This heater has two holes. Holes are measured from the gap. This heater has one hole at 270 degrees and one hole at 90 degrees. Both of these holes are centered on the width of the band heater. And both are three quarters of an inch in diameter. We then need to define the watts and volts. This particular heater is 1,250 watts at 240 volts. This band heater features a stainless steel outer sheath with incorporated straps. The standard outer sheath is the aluminized steel seen on this band heater as the inner sheath. Thank you for watching this video.